One of the big problems with the future is that we can't predict it. So we're forced to use our imaginations. I think all of us are really caught up in the present and in the short term. Politicians have to think about the next election. Business leaders have to think about the next quarter. The uh, environment has a much different clock. In my view, uh, stories are a wonderful way to organize uh, thinking uh, about the future. We are a storytelling species. Um, stories have um, been a way that we've um, communicated throughout time. So we're creating a set of four scenarios um, for the Ahara watershed, and each scenario looks at a distinct um, pathway of change in the area through the year 2070. Well, the writing process is really a lot of sitting at a desk, staring at a computer, thinking, trying to imagine, occasionally looking out the window. <laughs> when I was your age, this merganser would have had trouble finding a place to nest. So I was brought into the project uh, as the illustrator to help give some additional life to four narratives that Jenny has written. We start with the abandonment scenario. Things just become so catastrophic that people, in essence, can't deal with the situation a bit more anarchistic than the other three scenarios. At any part of the world, something like the abandonment scenario is actually taking place. It's really easy to find references for how people might be cobbling a life together. I'll bet someone would have made a trailer like this, just from old skid lumber or something. The second scenario is called connected communities. People will come together, kind of a, a hearkening back to earlier values. In accelerated innovation, we use technology as our silver bullet to solve all of our in, in problems with the environment. It becomes a bit more difficult to, to illustrate. You know, if you just think back about, the, let's say, the last even 25 years and the existence of all sorts of things in our lives that never existed before, the uh, final scenario is called nested watersheds. There is a recognition that water has become so important that we should restructure governance around the water. The challenge to readers of the scenarios is to decide what the good elements are and how the bad things could be left behind. We will see enormous environmental changes by 2070, even though it seems a long way off, is, is close enough that we all have a stake.